ending another day. Had a very productive day. I am currently have finished my last customer. Relaxing. Heading my way back to the hotel. I am so blessed to have had a productive day. I hope everybody had a productive day. I'm telling y'all, life is too short. Y'all better get it. I know I'm getting it, boy. I had an extremely productive day. Extremely productive day. So you can tell when you're in the South because everybody be waving at your ass. That's some Southern stuff. Let me tell you something. Say what you want to say about the South. Y'all want to say we slow, we country, but I see everybody ass moving here. That's all I'm going to say. North Florida is the South. South Florida is the South. Y'all just don't realize it. I'm telling you, man, I just left one of my customers. This is what I'm talking about, how uh, I might want to put my damn seatbelt on while I'm talking. Just in case. this baby that's what I'm talking about this is what these people be paying I be telling people people pay for peace say what you want to say hate all you want to hate customer I just left is from Long Beach California he moved to Kingsland <clears throat> Georgia he was uh, said he was an hourly guy his whole life meaning he was a W-2 and he worked his butt off lived in an apartment his whole life in California come over here by his dream retirement home, okay? Now, if you see the people walking by as I'm driving, a lot of these people are not retired, okay? Some of them are. But at the end of the day, we all got to work for something. Don't hate people that's willing to get out here and work for it. What you need to do is develop relationships so you can figure out how you can do it for yourself. I'm telling you, favor ain't fair. So this is what I like about the areas I service and where I work because it's like before I even get to the crib, I'm detoxing. I'm clearing my head right now. I'm trying to figure out, okay, I need to get an evening workout in. Am I going to go? I think I'm going to be going to <clears throat> Planet Fitness because for some reason, I have not been able to focus in my hotel. But that's probably because I got so much on my mind. But at the end of the day, it really felt like I got options. Y'all hear that yarn right? It's now 6.20 p.m. Eastern Time. Y'all know I'd be messed up because I work on multiple coasts, so I don't even know where I'm at and what I'm doing sometimes, but I'm doing it. That's all I know. But with that said, let's reflect on the day. My day started in Kingsland. Then I had to bounce over to the brand new uh, Jacksonville Marcon. Shout out to Marcon a whole bag. In fact, why don't y'all let me hold something? Shout out to Marcon. Saul, you heard me. Let me hold something. Because when I tell you that 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 uh, this distribution fitness, uh, center is state of the art, brand new, I'm seeing, I'm telling you, we looking at, that's, I'm telling you that's seven figures. I already know. Between the construction, the inventory, I'm telling you, they own it all day. Nothing but love number love song and plus they take very good care of their customers you say what you let me tell y'all y'all better team up with the people that's got the bag and i'm here to tell you my cone got the bag and the parts and the information and the training just remind me msa make sure you get your msa membership and then people ask me about insurance you need to hook up with msa they got the insurance connect and all that y'all trying to figure out what to do you got some of your largest vendors got group rates for you on a lot of situations. You, if you know like I know, you get it together. I really hate when people, y'all gotta give me a moment because y'all, Billy Bob is on the back on my back here. Like, come on, man, stop whistling Dixie and let a sister get by. Dang. Anyway, y'all know I don't care. It'll be all right. Don't take it personal. It's just my epic sense of humor. Did I ever tell you guys my next, everybody who knows me, who's close to me, I, they know my next career is going to be stand-up comedy because I can't make this up, man. What I say is exactly how I feel. When y'all start laughing and rolling, I'm really feeling that way. Like, I don't really even know what's funny because I'm serious as a heart attack when I'm talking about some of the things I'm experiencing. 
I'm just putting it in uh, terms that I understand. Skip for everybody else. But anyway, let's get back to my day. All right, so we did Jacksonville, Bill Marcon, had to grab some stuff. Great experience. Got to hang out with uh, Sam and them. Great experience. Great move, Marcon. Then I popped over to, jo to the other part of Georgia, about Austin, Georgia. I had some jobs to knock out in about Austin, Georgia. Once I finished about Austin, Georgia, I had to bounce right back over to Kingsland because I had jobs here for late afternoon customers. Plus, I had to pick up my parts. Because wherever I'm working, I always have my parts dropped that dropped out dropped in those areas, whether it be UPS, wherever. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, I have a whole system. When I tell you my stuff is logistically sound, believe me, that's why I'm able to run like this and get paid like this. I'm telling you, because I don't have no obstacles. The only obstacle I have is improper planning or laziness. And I have no intention of having that. My stuff come back to discipline. Right, and then I got a class tonight. I think my class at eight o'clock. Be hanging out with my boy Jared, getting that other part of the game we doing. And that's what I'm saying. You gotta have a circle of people. Like for instance, in every venture I take, I have an accountability partner. Like I, you know, I got some uh, back end IT stuff I'm working on, going through a course, and I got an accountability partner that I have a relationship with. Well, we push each other, we check on each other, we make sure each one is on top of our game because we have multiple interests, but we ain't about to be left behind. As long as you got time, you got time to get paid. You got time to get trained. You got time to learn a new skill. And that's one thing about me. I believe in getting bags from every angle. And if I see something's coming and I'm not preparing, I'm the problem. And that's what I tell people. Y'all be tripping. Y'all better get out here and get this bag. Man, I'm about to pass by Planet Fitness too. But the problem is I don't have my workout gear. And the reality is I need to unload this and, and I need to reach out to some clients. But that's basically how my, my day went. And uh, everything was really great, you know. It was really a great experience. I got a chance to talk to some of my rounds table members, make sure they were good. They reached out for me that for advice and support. I reached out to them. That's what I mean. Y'all better get a group of people you can count on and make sure you stay away from the leeches because a lot of people out here just drain you. They ain't bringing nothing to the table. They just draining the hell out your ass. For real. Y'all better recognize the parasites and leeches. Get rid of them because if not, they're going to get rid of you, drain you, and then drop you if you know what I know. But anyway, you know I'm talking smack because that's what I do. But the day was a good day. Six feet above ground. You know what I say? Let me let me give it the day. Let me give up that day, Ramsey. Better than I deserve. That's how I'm doing. And I'm blessed and I know it. I'm telling you, I got all my senses about me. I'm a little round and brown, but I'm, you know, somewhat healthy. So at the end of the day, is what I do. Grab me some oranges from Publix earlier. Cause I'm telling y'all, I better get on this fruit game, because fruit will make you healthy. In fact, I do need to stop by Publix again. Actually, because I need to get some grapes and some melons. I think I got some melons in the fridge at the hotel, but you know what? I'm not doing that because then that's going to be a whole nother tangent. You ever been in a space where you was like, you know what? I really want to stop and do this, but I know if I stop, I'm going to be losing time. This is the hardest thing in the world is time management, man. Time management and execution. Consistent execution. Even when you don't want to. That right there is a whole bar. But, like I said, I'm too blessed to be stressed. So I'm getting ready to roll back into my hotel. Get ready for tomorrow. Man, as bad as I want some fall. Every time, it's a place here. P-H-O, fall. If you don't drink, if you don't do fall soup, something's wrong with you. Vietnamese, this is like the best soup in the world. You just got to get the right spot. So let me tell y'all something. Expand your horizons. Go to your, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Go to TripAdvisor. TripAdvisor is my go-to when it comes to restaurant because I don't know what these people be doing, but they travel the world and they find places like, I'll never forget, I was living in Seattle, right? And I had a crib out in um, a place called Bellevue. And then my partner was in the Navy, so she lived out on Whippy Island, Oak Harbor, right? So she had a crib out there. Let me tell y'all something. As much as we used to go, because you know when you got families and friends, what are you doing on the weekend? Your ass go eat. You know, that's what we do. We go eat.
Man, let me tell you something. There was the best far spot <clears throat> right in the neighborhood. I didn't know till I went to TripAdvisor. Because TripAdvisor, they got the best reviews. <coughs> they have the best reviews. Like, I, everybody else stuff I don't trust, but I trust TripAdvisor. Because they never steer me wrong. So go to TripAdvisor. Start expanding your mind, man. And go check out the restaurants they rank. And then look at the dishes they rank. You know, try something you haven't tried before. You know? I'm telling you, y'all got to learn how to expand your mind, man. Because faith ain't fair and life is too short. But that's my gospel for the day. Y'all be good. Just want to give you a little recap with a little chuckle. Y'all be blessed. I'm getting ready to turn this part of my life off <clears throat> and turn the other part of my life on. Be good, be blessed, and stay encouraged.